Here's a question from Judy. We hear all of our second floor plumbing, toilet flushes, sinks, showers, tubs, draining down our walls. Is there any way to correct this? All right, Judy, you could hold it, then you wouldn't hear a thing. I'm just kidding. All right, my guess is your waste and vent in your home is made of plastic, PVC, and it is super noisy. They run those pipes through the interior walls and they don't insulate them. In a perfect world, you'd open up that wall and insulate all those pipes to temper that sound. Now, if there are specific areas where, you know, you can hear it like, oh, right there, I hear the water running when someone's in the shower or flushing the toilet. You could try some spray foam insulation. You have to be very careful because if you use too much of this, it could actually bow the wall. So be careful and try not to listen to it so much. Hey Lou, my name's Christy, I'm from Boston, Massachusetts. I have a great room above my garage that has electrical but it has no heat and that's the room my kids like to play in. What can I do? So even though you don't have any heat there, the kids still love to go into that room, right? They must be really tough. Okay, you probably want to install electric baseboard heat. Now this is something you're gonna to have to get an electrician to do because to be as efficient as possible, it should be a 240 system, meaning that it takes a little bit more energy to run these things. But you'll find a huge selection when it comes to these, and there are oil-filled electric baseboard heaters. They have their own thermostat, as I mentioned, and the beauty part of having the oil inside of it is that it has residual properties, meaning that you'll have the thermostat set for, say, 70 degrees, completely safe for your kids to be around, and when the room reaches 70 degrees, it shuts down. But since it has oil inside of it, remember there's fins covering it up so the kids can't get at it, it still permeates heat out there while you're not paying for any electricity. The oil's hot, but the electric is off. So this should go on the outside walls of these rooms because that's where you lose the most heat. And if you plan it correctly, that room will be nice and toasty and it'll be a great room that the kids continue to love going into.